You know that expression, you learn something new every day? Well, here on Paige's Lessons, I'm going to share with you a variety of insights and self-reflections that will inspire and motivate you to rethink how you process and experience life. I'll be giving my best advice on topics such as relationships, career, and overall life transitions. I can't wait to share these golden nuggets with you. Let's get started. Today, something happened where I was reminded to step back into my power. I am a recovering people pleaser and it tends to creep up on me. And today it was very apparent that I lost my own voice. I lost my vision because I was too busy pleasing other people, making sure I was keeping the peace and just not listening to my own voice and not stepping into the leadership role that I know I am. And um, yeah, I just want to chat in this episode about stepping into your power and what that actually looks like and what that means. So just for some context, I'm working on a specific project and I'm super excited to launch it and um, there's a lot of other people involved and as the creator of this project I do have a vision for what I want it to look like but because I give a shit about other people's opinions and I want everyone to contribute um, something happened where Um, I guess without giving it away, like a part of the project really like fell apart and I just kind of like, it was just a wake up call for me to be like, wait a minute, what the fuck am I doing? Like, I don't know if this has happened to you before, but if you're like working on something, you have a vision, you know why you're doing it and you're focused, but then like random shit happens and stuff falls through the cracks and then you're left with this outcome and you're just like wait a minute this isn't my original vision and so you kind of forgot like how you got here and so what happened to me today was I was just shocked and had to take a step back when I was looking at this overall project And instead of like beating myself up for like, oh my God, I can't believe I let this happen. Um, And like getting down on myself, I stepped into my power. I reassessed my vision and my goals and what I'm doing to contribute. And I immediately took action. Like I was shocked for sure um, that I let other people's opinions take over and for my voice to just kind of feel like, you know, it didn't really matter, but fuck that. Like I'm the creator of this project. I have a vision and I'm brave enough to voice, Hey, this isn't cool. And let's, um, let's look at the course, reset the course basically and take action. So that's exactly what I did. Um, I, I seeked some guidance. I got some support to kick my ass into gear and I immediately took action and now I feel so much better. Um, I wrote out all of my feelings, um, like just on a piece of paper, just for myself, wrote it all out. And then, um, I took the next step, which was to communicate. Um, and yeah, so I, the lesson of the day <laughs> is if you feel like whether you're people pleasing or for whatever reason, you are not speaking up, you are not saying your truth, something is preventing you from owning your own voice, um, I would just say, please remember who the fuck you are, why you're showing up and to take course of action immediately 
because life is too damn short to let other people boss you around, tell you what to do, whether that's physical people or society, expectations, culture, like you have to do what's right for you and what is aligned with your goals and your vision. And I was really reminded of that today because I got really lost and sidetracked and disappointed in myself, but I'm so glad now that like shit kind of hit the fan for me to wake the fuck up and be like, no, I'm not accepting this anymore. This isn't my truth. And yeah, I just, I feel so much more confident. I'm so excited to roll this project out and take the next step. So if you're listening to this and you're thinking about, hmm, like, I wonder where in my life maybe I'm being quiet or maybe I'm not speaking up as much. Maybe it's in my relationship or at work. Um, Where else can you speak a little louder? Where else can you stand up for yourself and speak your truth? And when you do, just know like you are being your highest version of yourself. You are, you're amazing, you're capable, and you can fucking do it. And now a quick shout out to our sponsor. Thanks for listening. If you enjoyed this episode and you'd like to help support the podcast, please share it with others. Post about it on social media or head over to your favorite podcast platform to subscribe, rate, and leave a review. Subscribing and posting a review helps to improve engagement and is essential for the podcast to be discovered by new listeners. Thanks again for listening. And remember, every day provides a lesson. Take care.